Hello friends, James Corbett, enjoying a nice sunny day here in the sunny climes of western Japan, and I'm sure my audience doesn't need to be reminded about this, but just for any newbies out there, of course we know that the dreaded conspiracy theorist label, oh the worst thing you can be called, you're a conspiracy theorist, was not invented by the CIA, that's a straw man that's sometimes used to debunk this idea, but was popularized by the CIA through its agents in the Operation Mockingbird program in the American media as a result of their 1967 memo CIA document 1035-960. If you haven't seen it, I will of course put the link in the show notes so you can go and see it directly for yourself where they talk about countering criticism of the Warren report and people who dare to believe that perhaps Lee Harvey Oswald wasn't the lone nut that we were told he was. Well, one of the ways that they suggest countering such criticism is to label the crackpots who deride that notion as conspiracy theorists. They do use that term in the document. And lo and behold, uh, yes, the conspiracy theorist term was employed in the media with increasing frequency from that point. I wonder why. Well, as I say, I'm sure most of my regular audience already knows that story. So I uh, got an interesting little thought experiment in recently via email from Jacob. <laughs> I actually don't remember the name. So Jacob or whoever you are, I'm very sorry if I got your name wrong. But uh, I did appreciate the thought experiment, which was basically along these lines. We all know that conspiracy, of course, is an actual crime. Conspiracy to commit murder, conspiracy to launder money, conspiracy to commit a bank robbery, whatever. People are actually charged with and convicted of the crime of conspiracy every single day. But if, so technically speaking, any police detective that's looking for unnamed or unknown associates of the person who they have in custody is a conspiracy theorist. He's theorizing that there may have been a conspiracy. I mean, so it is really ridiculous to use this as some sort of pejorative label. Well, let's imagine if we applied that in another context. What if there was something like burglary theorist? What if in the 1960s as the CIA or whatever deep state agency had decided to make burglary theorist the uh, term that they would implant in the media? And thereby, over the course of, you know, half a century of conditioning, people would be scared to even talk about burglary or their thoughts on the possibility that burglary exists. Uh, you might go back to your home one day and find all the windows smashed and all the valuables have been taken, the whole place has been ransacked, and you turn to your friend and you say, you know, I think there was a burglary here, and your friend, oh, you burglary theorist, what are you talking about? Or we might imagine the uh, nightly news broadcast where they come on and say, very strange phenomenon sweeping across Main Street last night. A, a number of shops had their, their windows broken in and money was missing from the cash registers. Uh, the police say they have no idea what happened, but there's already a number of burglary theories uh, popping up online. I mean, insert your own joke here. We could see <laughs> quite easily how stupid such an idea, such a system would be. And of course, of course, who would benefit from that? The burglars, of course. People who commit burglary would love if burglary theorist was some pejorative phrase and no one wants to talk about burglary. Of course. So who does it benefit that conspiracy theory is this big thought crime and you can't dare broach the subject? People who conspire, which really happens and people are really convicted for, but still don't talk about it. Don't talk about it. Do you see how this works? I think that's a great little thought experiment. So my thanks to Jacob, question mark, for sending that idea in. And, uh, you know, I think we should start using it, maybe uh, flipping the tables on people who use conspiracy theorists as a pejorative. Yay, yeah, well, you're a burglary theorist. Anyway, just thought I'd share that with you. Um, as always, thank you guys for the support. Talk to you again soon.